The NBA Board of Governors has given its approval to a new rule against flopping during games, as well as an expanded use of the coaches' challenge. These rules were tested during the 2023 Las Vegas Summer League and will now be implemented for the 2023-24 NBA season. According to the NBA, a flop is defined as a physical action that reasonably appears to be intended to deceive the officials into calling a foul on another player. Under the new rule, a player who is called for flopping will receive a non-unsportsmanlike technical foul, and the opposing team will be awarded one free throw. However, unlike a regular technical foul, players cannot be ejected for flopping. Officials are not required to immediately stop play to assess a flop. They can wait until the next suitable moment to avoid interrupting a team that has an immediate scoring opportunity. Flops cannot be directly reviewed using the coach's challenge. However, if a foul call or any other review initiated by the referees reveals a flop, it can be penalized. The league also has the authority to penalize flopping after a game, with the penalty being the same as a technical foul, which includes a $2,000 fine that can increase for repeat offenses. During a game, assessed flops will only result in a free throw for the opposing team, without any fine being imposed. This in-game flopping rule will be implemented as a one-year trial. The expanded coaches challenge now allows a team to have a second challenge if their first one is successful. A team still needs to use a timeout to initiate a challenge, but if the first challenge is successful, they will retain the timeout that was used. However, regardless of the outcome, a team will not retain the timeout used to trigger a second challenge, considering the flow and duration of the game. Under the previous rules, coaches would often save their challenge until the end of the game, in case they needed it for a crucial call. Unfortunately, this resulted in obvious incorrect calls earlier in the game being upheld because coaches were reluctant to use their challenge in the first half. By introducing the second challenge if the first one is successful, coaches will feel more at ease challenging calls that should have gone in their favor earlier in the game. They will also have an additional challenge remaining for critical moments later in the game. And here's a tip from the Los Angeles Lakers News Top Channel, study financial education and have a better quality of life, in the financial market, studying real estate investment trust REITs and stocks responsibly for passive income, even more.